Hello everyone, let me welcome you to a short demonstration on Git Rebase. But before we start, let me quickly introduce a scenario in which I personally like to use a rebase. Look at this Git log we have over here. So there is a master branch that is ahead of this feature branch. The feature branch is what we're currently working on. Now let's assume that on master there was a change that has been merged that is relevant for our change that we want to have so we can continue working. Wouldn't it be awesome if we could just take this branch and put it on top of master so that we have this change available on our branch and we can use it. This is exactly what a git rebase is for. So what we can do is I want to take these two commits and put them on top of master. As you can see I've already checked out feature consumer filter so I can go git rebase master and here we go. Now I can see that we've moved the two commits on top of master and we have the changes that we need and can work or can continue working. So it's as easy as that if there is no conflict. Now in this section I want to quickly show you what happens if we run into a conflict. So for that let's quickly check out master and perform some changes. You can see we have a consumer class here on the right which is on our master branch and we have the service here which has a filtering method and we're still on the master branch. So let's do two things. First let's rename this variable to filter service. Let's commit that and let's do another change up here. Let's add a comment. Perfect. Let's also commit that. Now we can see that master again moved ahead of our feature branch. So assume we keep working on our feature branch and it similar changes. Let's assume we also rename this to filter service. Let's commit that renamed variable in consumer and let's add a comment here as well. This is the consumer. So let's commit that. Added a comment in consumer and let's look at our log. We can now see that master is down here and we have two changes and our feature branch is up here and it's not integrated these two changes. So what we can do again is we can rebase on master, onto master to, well, say it correctly, I guess. So let's rebase onto master and what we can see is we run into a conflict. See, it tried to apply the commits to master. So it first uses this commit add filter method. You can see it's already put on top of master. Perfect. And it applied this second commit without any problem. Now on the third commit, renamed variable in consumer, we can see there is a conflict. But actually there is not. Because if we look at here, it tells us it's dropping this commit. It's dropping commit cc42 ah, 4795f. It's dropping this commit because the change is already made. It was the same change. I renamed the variable in both cases so it can just drop the commit. So the conflict is actually on this last one down here. So what does the conflict look like? So let's first go with git status and see both have modified, both commits have modified the consumer file. Let's look at it and we can see great both of them have modified it. So Let's use the incoming change, which is the change from our rebase or like the change from our consumer branch. Let's take that one. Let's go with that one. So after we've put the file into the actual state we want to have it in, we add the file to mark it as conflict free and we can continue our rebase. We will now have to confirm the commit message. Here we go. The rebase is done. So what that was supposed to show you is how to handle conflicts with rebase 
and that changes that are already there resulting in empty commits will just drop the commits so resulted in rebasing three commits. Lastly, we can quickly merge our branch to close our work. Let's merge it as no fast forward. We don't care about the commit message. Here we go. This keeps our history nice, clean and linear and we can easily see what has happened. Thank you for watching and if you want to learn more or hear more about my thoughts on git rebase, I recommend you reading the blog post that comes with this screencast. Thank you very much.